Hey what's up guys this is Sonip Sky and today I'm going to show you how to install Windows 11 LTSC on GNOME boxes so let's get started. So first open your web browser and search for Windows 11 LTSC. Now click on the first link from Microsoft. Now click on download Windows 11 IoT Enterprise LTSC. Now you need to fill this form you can fill any dummy data. And once after that, you will see a section to download the ISO. I have already downloaded ISO. I am not going to download it again. After that, you need to install GNOME boxes if you haven't already. And after that, click on it to open it. Now click on the plus icon at the top left and click on install from file. Now select the ISO which you just downloaded earlier. Now it may show as Windows 10. So we need to change it to Windows 11. You can give any name like Windows 11. After that make sure it is selected as UEFI. And after that make sure that the memory is set to at least 4 GB. And the disk space is at least 50 GB for Windows. And click on create. Now the installation process is quite simple. Now select your language settings and your keyboard settings now. Make sure to check this checkbox and click on next. Now accept the license terms. Now for disk partitioning, since this is a virtual machine, you don't need to worry about anything. Just click on next. Now click on install. Now this process is going to take a while, so I'm going to fast forward it. So finally the installation is complete now it is asking for setup part. So for this you need to disconnect from the internet on your host machine and if it is just stuck on checking for update then you need to restart your virtual machine. We are disconnecting from internet so that we can create a local account but if you want to use Microsoft account then you don't need to disconnect from internet. So I'm going to restart my virtual machine so that I can create a local account. Since I'm not connected to internet, it is allowing me to create a local account. So I'm just going to quickly create an account. Now make sure to turn off all these settings for privacy concerns.
So that's it for the video guys. We have successfully installed Windows 11 LTSC on GNOME boxes. Now if you want to enable the correct display you need to install spice tools and also make sure to enable folder sharing from the settings if you want to enable file transfer between host and the guest operating system so thank you for watching